here with Docs. Tonight we're going to be doing some flavors from Marble Valley Vapors. First up, Blood Moon. It is a strawberry custard. I've already, I've already dripped it too. Oh, okay. We've both already <laughs> dripped it. We are prepared. Yes. Just for this one though. Now, it is done at sub-ohm levels. Remember, if you are sub-ohming, please be using the correct batteries. Now, I apologize because there's no AC in my apartment right now, so I have fans on. My bad. But it doesn't affect the flavors. This one has a really rich, creamy strawberry and custard. Yeah, and it's not as heavy as most of your other custards, uh, like your vanilla custards and stuff like that. It's a little bit brighter because of the fruit, yeah. fruit flavor. The fruit. Flute. The flute flavor. My words, they're just working. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, we're going to do Little Tart. This one is a sweet little apple tart with a fresh side of vanilla custard. I am all about dim custards. So, them sending me a whole bunch of custards just made me a happy bunny. Don't ask about the bunny ears. <laughs> I felt like being silly tonight. So, I almost closed it. It smells really good. It does. You can taste the apple. It's not yeah. overpowering. It's not very overpowering. It's got a little hint of apple. And definitely has a kind of that tart uh, flavor oh to it. Clouds keep on going away. It makes me <laughs> sad. I like it's pretty good, yeah. I like this one. Alright, next up. I love these names. Next up is Stevie Custard. Um, Custard. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Ripe banana mixed into a velvety smooth custard. Dim custards. Yep. There's my... Oh, Juice down! down. <laughs> At least we're entertaining. Just a little bit. You ready? Almost. Oh, I smell the banana. That's a good custard. I like that custard. It tastes good. Um, not a banana person. I like it. So... That is a, that, it tastes like a banana custard. It's just not for me. She's weird. It's good. What gave that away? <laughs> no, I mean, if you like bananas and, I love the custard part of it. The banana part throws me off, but, can't live them all. Alright. Happy Hubby Cupcake. Banana. <laughs> <laughs> it's a banana cupcake with cream filling and vanilla frosting. I can't get it open. It's tink proof. Most things are. It smells like banana. I almost closed it again. <laughs> I do smell the cupcake and the frosting, which gets me all hyper, but... The banana doesn't? I like the cake part. I like all of it, but I like banana because I'm not crazy. Now, I wonder if, Ta if Rich has tried these. Tower of Vape would go... Bananas. There you go. <laughs> um, over it. I'm, again, not a banana person. Okay. My head is so hot. <laughs> Next up is Cinestick Danish. Sweet, buttery Danish, lightly sprinkled with cinnamon and a dash of vanilla and a hint of love. I like love. 
It tastes good. It tastes like chicken. No, I'm just kidding. I like to put it on toast. This smell is awesome. I'm not going to step over to it. I like that one. You get the, the Danish flavor. You get the cinnamon flavor. You can yeah. feel the love. Definitely cinnamon <laughs> Danish flavor. But since I'm weird on this one, cinnamon's not my favorite. Thing, bakery cinnamons at least I like the hot cinnamons but you definitely get that pure cinnamon flavor like you would as a cinnamon danish that's exactly what it's supposed oh, to be I made it blurry <laughs> <laughs> it won't unblur I broke it <laughs> I broke okay. it for reals <laughs> okay we're back <laughs> Jesus it never fails. Never fails. I always break something. Okay, next up is buried Danish. It is no flavor profile on the bottom. <laughs> Probably tastes like a berry Danish. <laughs> That'd be my guess. <laughs> it bamboozled me. Oh crap! <laughs> <laughs> this is a great review. We are we are professionals. <laughs> Don't try this at home. Being us. Pretty much. This is what happens when we don't review with each other for a while. I think my battery's dead. <laughs> <laughs> you can go ahead and review this one. I'll, I'll share. How about that? Uh, you can share. There we go. It tastes like a Danish with fresh berries on it. It does. I actually really like that one. I, I'm a fan of um, mixed berries uh, instead of like your apples and stuff like that on fruits. So this is a really good one that I like. So if you like a berry flavor, it's for you. It's really good. Um, Marble Valley never lets me down. Um, true enough, I don't like all their flavors. It happens. Everybody likes different flavors. As you can tell, stuff I liked, he was eh on. Stuff he liked, I was eh on. So... The one thing I, I admire about Marble Valley is if it says it's supposed to taste like it, it tastes like oh, it. Oh, and it smells like it. and it's So if, if you don't like apples, don't get the apple one because it's going to taste like apple. And uh, <laughs> Jen over there is awesome. She makes great juices and they do, like, all of mine are sent to me in 1090. Don't go out of focus again. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll be back later with some other reviews. <laughs> Sorry, this one was kind of all over the place. Hopefully our next one will be a little bit better. <laughs> you guys have a great night.